You can see the scene behind us, Conference USA Media Day unfolding. Please be joined by Kevin Strong, who is now entering his senior season. So yes, what does it mean to you that you just have a, a semester left and a season left here? Yeah, it's been such a long road. It's, um, it's exciting. It's really exciting to know how far I came because I didn't think I was going to be at college at one point. I plan on going to the Air Force or whatever, but see where I'm at now, man. I'm just excited and ready to finish and do everything I got to do this last year. How cool is it to be able to be here? You look at this setting to represent your school in this atmosphere. Yeah, it's an honor. I know, um, I never expected to do this um, or whatever. My coach came up to me a few months ago, talking about, well, you going to represent us at Media Day. I'm like, oh, man, I got to get ready. So, I mean, it's an honor. It's fun. Good to um, be able to see the atmosphere and be my first time. So, it's a good experience. Have you gotten a chance or we get a chance to kind of interact with some of the other players? And I know you guys compete against each other, but what's it like to be in this setting and kind of talk to them without the, the stress or the pressure of trying to beat them on the field? <laughs> uh, it's, a little, it's a little different, man, but I, um, I haven't got to talk to a bunch of the guys yet, but I'm sure it'll be a cooler time for us all to get to know each other. You know, when we're on the field, it's business. No, hey, no home feelers, but whenever we're out the field, we know how to keep it um, cordial and stuff and be cool with each other, so it'll be nice. So the big question, obviously, that, that guy, you know, that Marcus Davenport guy, he's not there. You know, he's on to he's on to some big things. What becomes a challenge for you guys, or now, what do you need to do to step up to, to replace him out there? Um, our biggest thing, we wanted to make it look like Marcus haven't even left. You know, um, like Coach always say, the next man up. So Marcus gone now, so the next man got to step up and be ready to do what he did, or take on his position and be able to hold his position. So we steady working, we steady um, workouts. Same routine, steady going through it, same mindset, bowl game, conference championship, same, same, everything the same. It's just Mark's not there this time, so we got somebody to step up for him, and we're going to be ready to go. The defense should once again be the strong point of this team. Is that exciting to you know that, hey, you guys have one of the best defenses in this conference? Yeah, and then, you know, I was looking at a tweet um, the other day, and it said Marshall was the best defense in the conference. And it, it kind of, I got a little angry off of that because of all the work we put in. But, you know, it's cool. We're going to let people think what they want to think. We're going to continue to work. Uh, coming from where we came from last year, being the number two defense and being in that talk or whatever. So it'll be a good thing to build off of and show people that we could continue to keep striving. So it'll be something to do. What have you worked on in these off-season workouts? And you really haven't gotten into the, the grit of the, the practice in fall camp, but for yourself, did you go back last year and say, this is one thing I want to improve on personally? Yes, sir. Um, Mainly just trying to stay healthy, um, make sure I get out my treatment, rehab and stuff and staying healthy. Um, also, my conditioning. That's one thing I'm big, like I want to do way better. So I've been running a lot more and stuff. Um, weights come, you know, there's been lifting weights and everything. But mainly my conditioning. I want to be able to keep on being able to go play after play with no problem. So that'll, it'll be my biggest thing. And finally, do you guys have a goal after not making the bowl last year? Have you set out a goal to say, you know, we want this. This is what we want to accomplish this year. The main thing is to get to seven games, not six. Don't leave it up for grabs. We guarantee that we're going to get in the bowl this year. Not no bid, not no thoughts. We want you to know we're going to be in the bowl ready to compete. So that's the biggest thing. Make sure you win game seven, not six, seven. <laughs> that's what you heard it from the man manning the D-line, Kevin Strong. <laughs> You're watching Sports Tonight, San Antonio's only nightly 30-minute sportscast with exclusive sports coverage you won't find anywhere else.